So we'll take a look at Isotopes Repair Assistant. That is one of the tools available in RX Elements bundle. We can also get it for cheaper in Elements Suit. So this whole Element Suit, which includes Nectar, Neutron, RX Element, and Ozone, is currently cheaper than buying RX Elements only. So always make sure you buy the right one. And we can go now to our digital audio workstation. I'm using Adobe Edition, but you can easily install Isotope in any digital audio workstation that you use. I have it in Reaper and I have it in Audacity as well. And we're going to go to effects here, VST3, restoration, Isotope and repair assistant. And it has quite a few parameters hit right here. You can, uh, you have a feature where you can select what kind of audio you're working on. I only work, usually I work on voice only. So I always leave it at, at the first one, but you can use it for music, percussion, sound effects, and so on. And in order to apply it, you're gonna play your audio and then you're gonna click learn. So it will listen to that portion of your audio recording and it will give you these settings right here. So I can like, put them at random now, right? And we're gonna play it. This is a sample order that we will be working on using Isotope Repair Assistant and we'll check all the functionalities that it has. I just need, right, so it's, it has done its job. And now we determine some of these parameters. So it's nice that you can enable or disable particular uh, effects. So in this case, determine that you don't really need a de-reverb but I might just apply it if I want to and then and vice versa I can disable the yes if I don't really like it and you can adjust it to your liking yourself if you want to and also I really like this one because you can listen to let's say just the reverb that it gets rid of or maybe just the uh, the like the sounds that DS gets rid of or clicks that it gets rid of it does a pretty good job so if we listen to the reverb right we can listen to clicks So it's nice, nice, nice feature it has, and probably the best portion of it is the denoise part here, because a lot, of, well, not a lot, but some digital audio workstations don't have built-in noise reduction tool. I, I believe Reaper doesn't have it, and so you can get this one, which is gonna be better than most of the built-in noise reduction tools. For example, Adobe Audition has a noise reduction tool. I prefer this one, Audacity has it as well. I prefer Isotopes. It's gonna give you a better quality. It, it's easy to use. I like to apply it. So let's apply it and let's see what's the difference here. And yeah, we are done. And usually I apply Repair Assistant after I'm done using Noise Gate. So Noise Gate will clean my audio in between my vocals. And then I use uh, Repair Assistant to further clean up my, my uh, vocals in the recording. And that's a quick review of this particular tool.